In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to use a video file to create a simple chroma key in vScope Live. Normally, vScope Live works with a live camera feed, but we're going to use a file for this demo so you can see how it works. The first step is to download the trial version of vScope Live from www.vscope.com. Once you've downloaded the trial, install the software. After you've downloaded and installed vScope Live, go to the examples page and download the media for this tutorial. After the media has finished downloading, take a look at the download. You'll see two images. There's a background image and a foreground image. You will need these files for this tutorial later. The next thing to do is to start vScope Live from your Applications folder. Click on the QuickTime File menu. Bring up the files that you just downloaded. Change the aspect ratio to 16 by 9. Click on the soft light tab and select the S button to sample the background. Click on the soft light switch. Click on the mask. Now adjust the foreground gain. Bring up the contrast. Click on the Background tab. Open the background. And now you have a simple key shot in vScope Live. You may want to treat the aspect ratio to native, and you can also zoom around the image to position it where you want it to go. And that's how you use vScope Live to create a simple chroma key. For more information, visit www.vscope.com.